Hey, it's Grillin' Bam here with Bama Barbecue. Today I wanna to share one of my favorite rib recipes with you. It's a St. Louis cut rib that I marinate in teriyaki sauce and then I finish it off with a sweet chili sauce mixed with a little bit of orange mandarin. You're gonna love it. This is how we're gonna do it. Let's go out and get the smoker going. I'm using the new GMG ledge for this one. But before I get started, I'm gonna fill up the hopper with some of those GMG blend pellets. I'm using an oak hickory cherry. Let's get the smoker set to 225 degrees. We're gonna go in, we're gonna clean up the ribs, pull the membrane off the back. We're gonna marinate the ribs. You can use a large pan or you could use a large Ziploc bag. We're gonna fill it with the teriyaki marinade. Make sure that the meat side is down in the pan or if you use a bag, make sure that it's full enough to where the ribs are submerged in the juice. After that, you want to put it in the fridge, let it rest for about an hour. Now it's time to put them on the smoker. The smoker is up to temperature. We're at 225 degrees. We're going to put these babies on. We're going to let them roll for about an hour and a half to two until they get tender. Now that the ribs have been on the smoker at 225 degrees for two and a half hours, we're going to pull them off. We're going to take them in. We're going to slice them up individually. Then we're going to throw them back in the pan. We're going to pour our sauce mixture over the top of it. You want to combine your quarter cup of mandarin, quarter cup of chili sauce, quarter cup of teriyaki glaze. Mix all the ingredients into one bowl and stir thoroughly. Now that we poured the sauce over the ribs, we're gonna take the ribs, we're gonna cover them with foil, and then we're gonna put them back on the grill at 250 degrees for 45 minutes. Slice up your green onions, get those ready to top it off, and then set aside your whole sesame seed. After 45 minutes, the ribs are done, they're nice and tender and juicy. We're gonna bring them in, we're gonna let them rest, and then we're gonna plate them. First, we're gonna hit them with a little green onion, then we're gonna come back and top them with a little sesame seed, and then it's time to eat. There you go, St. Louis style Asian ribs by Grillin' Bam. Hope you enjoy the recipe. Keep cooking.